Okay, welcome back to Dark Souls 2, the ultimate sorcerer's guide. I'm back after a few days of absence. I'm finally done with all my big papers in school. Um, I have nothing more to worry about, so I can finally get back to recording every day. Last time I fought the, or attempted to fight, the smelter demon. Unfortunately, a glitch got in my way. People have been telling me in the comments that this is pretty common, so... Yeah, I didn't like discover anything new, but yeah, I got back here. I'm in human form, summoned Lucatil. I had to use a Twilight Herb to restore my spell uses, but yeah, we should be fine. Hopefully, things go better than they did last time. All right, let's go, Lucatil. Really, it seems like this guy is pretty resistant to um, magic. So I think my main source of damage is going to be coming from counters with the Leo ring. Yeah, the damage is... there is a significant difference. Plus, if Lucatil manages to distract him, things will be A-OK. -okay. He's doing the... He's only doing this. There is no reason not to get a bit of damage in. If you can. That was terribly timed. I can dodge a lot better than that. I don't know if he's gonna blow. Yeah, he is. Still got the counter, I think. Ah, oh, he's going for his sword. I'm gonna switch to Great Heavy Soul Arrow. Get some damage in here. Alright, Luke Teal, just try to hold out. I do this. I might as well spend all of these. No reason not to. And yeah, he might blow. You can never tell when he's gonna do the explosion or not. Oh shit. You have to Crap, fuck. He did the three hit combo. God, this guy is annoying. I don't know. I didn't have so much trouble on him with my dex character, but yeah, he is kind of an irritating boss. Ah well. He is completely optional, so it's like whatever, but you know what? I'm not going to summon Lucatil. I can always summon... See, the thing is, I the thing that I'm scared about is if I don't do this fight with her, there is like a tiny chance that she won't make it uh, through the Rotten, and if she doesn't, that basically screws up my chances of getting her gear. So that is the only reason I wanna, or I might wanna summon her for this fight. Ah, shit. Well done, f well done weapon. Just completely miss your target. Yeah, my, I need to, like, desperately increase my adaptability. Alright. So I'm gonna go ahead and cut here. I'll be back in a second. Okay, so I cut a little while ago. My plan was to fight or well th my plan was to not waste more humanities or human effigies and on this boss fight so my brilliant plan was to lay down my summon sign and use the bonus which is if you win you turn back into human use that uh, to not have to waste any human effigies that didn't work out so well uh, on my first uh, summoning I got killed right at the end. The final hit of the smelter demon killed me. While on the second one, the host died, unfortunately. But, as I was going through, I noticed that I had 23,000 souls, which means that I'm very close to being able to get an extremely important item from Strayed. So I thought, why not go back, use a couple of consumable souls, I don't know who thought that putting a bonfire here is a good idea, but let me tell you, it's not. Especially since these guys are around here. Alright, I think that's the last of them. What do these guys drop? Oh yeah, alluring skulls. What I'm gonna do is go into my inventory, and I think if I use one of these, this should be enough. Yes. 
Should be just enough. Yeah, 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 you need souls, you need souls. I know. This is what we want. This is the Ring of Knowledge. I think this is pretty much a good place to get this ring. Very useful. It increases intelligence by five fucking points. Which, let me tell you, is a lot. Can I trade anything to him? I've already gotten this. Haven't I gotten this? Yeah, I have. Alright, that's about it. What does he say, by the way? Okay, which old kingdom? Why didn't anyone wake me sooner? <laughs> this guy is so awesome. Yeah, I think if you talk to him, you, he pretty much talks about uh, Olafis, which is his homeland. Now, this makes me worry. Do I have the... Yeah, I do have the spell. Oh, yeah? Insufficient attributes, you say? Well, what do you have to say now? What? Wait, wait, wait. Ah, oh, shit. I'm such an idiot. These guys... Of course, resting at the bonfire makes these guys respawn. This is like such a stupid place to put a bonfire. I can't even believe it. There it is. I think... Yep. Now we have enough. Alright. This spell <laughs> still doesn't do too much damage. Uh, seems pretty... Yeah, it does home pretty well. Alright. So there's that. And what that also means is I can switch this out to something else. I don't know what would look cool. I'm all hollowed out. This helmet doesn't look too bad. We'll go with this. Kind of looks stupid, but we're fine for now. Alright. Let's go back to the Iron Keep. And I'm going to skip the Smelter Demon now. For now, because fuck him. I'll just go and I should have enough time to get to the old Iron King. He's not a difficult boss at all. The problem is we have to get through quite a long section with no bonfire. But you know what? We should have no problems in the end. Do want to... No, we want to not use this spell for now. Can I use Soul Spear? Wait a second, where is it? No, still not there. Alright. This is what I had. Um, That heavy soul arrow or homing heavy soul arrow is probably useful, but... I don't think it's really useful in this situation. It only has 8 castings. Probably good for PvP. It's gonna depend on how well it homes on enemies. But yeah, I'm glad I got this ring. I've been planning to get it for a long time. I just kind of forgot about it. But like I said, this is a good time to get it. Because I want to use all the souls I can get from the actual bosses to level up my stats. Yeah, you get to watch me do this all over again. This section is pretty shitty. I have to say that getting back to the Smelter Demon is one of the more annoying kind of like boss runbacks. I don't know if this guy is going to aggro, but we'll take him out just in case. They're so quick with their attacks. But... Backstabbing, backstabbing them is pretty easy. Shit. Just don't get hit. Yeah, like I said, gonna need all the souls I can get from actual bosses because there's a lot of stats that I still need. Uh, for example, I still need to... I need to increase my dex a little bit. Because I'm going to need the Jester Helm, which increases item finds. Plus, of course, intelligence is always something we have to work on. And I'd like to get like a few more points into strength. Because... 
I want to switch my shield out to, like, I don't know, I guess the target shield would be one that's pretty good. I've been looking at. In some ways it's better than this shield, in other ways it's worse. But I think it is more stable, so... Yeah, I think I might want to get that. Anyways, as you can see, this is pretty easy. With sorceries. At least I don't have to f spend fucking souls on crossbow bolts and everything. And then the crossbow is not my favorite ranged weapon. It is a lot better here than in Dark Souls. But still. Okay, good, that hit. You know what, I'm not gonna spend all my castings on these assholes. Because we have plenty more enemies to take out. Alright. This guy's probably gonna... Yep, he's gonna shoot at me. And go in. Good. I was worried he was gonna hit me in the back. But he didn't. Alright, we're gonna... Seriously? Now switch to your fucking... There you go. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead. Shit. Not what I meant to do. I thought you could jump down here, but... Apparently you cannot. Oh, does he not follow me? I thought he did. Well, you might as well fall off if you're there. What the fuck? Yeah. Okay. That's not good. And now he decides to fall off. Brilliant. Alright, you know what? I think I'm gonna clear at least this part out off screen. I'll see you guys in a second. Thinking about it now, um, this might be an easier way to go. We don't have to deal with that. Alone Knight Captain. Plus, this guy for some reason seemed not to react. Ah oh well, if he doesn't want to do anything, that's his loss. Wonder if I can... Can I hit him? If I can, yep, that's really good. Uh, that's gonna help out a ton. Oh, did I push him out of range? Shit. Wait for him to shoot. That was like the worst dodge ever. I'll... Right, we can also take out that one. But I'm wondering if he is in range. Good. He is. Yeah, just climb up. Do that. Oh, well, maybe not. It's interesting how, even now in this game, the AI doesn't really know how to react once you use or start using ranged attacks. Kind of weird. I wish they could have, uh, they would have fixed that. But they didn't. Uh, this guy's gonna be a pain in the ass. The problem is, at this stage with my HP, enemies can basically kill me in two hits. And these guys like to do like two hit combos and shit like that. But, a backstab certainly helps. Oh, by the way, that fucking alarm from last episode is still going off. Or not still, but it's going off again. I don't know what the fuck that is. Because they are doing construction, like, down the street. But it shouldn't make this much fucking noise, should it? Alright. These guys are really susceptible to the Leo ring. Because they have that long wind-up on all of their attacks. Oh, don't... No, 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 no. Shit. I was worried there for a second. Alright, you're dead. Is he going to... Destroy the floor. Yeah, he did. These guys are also weak to magic, which is... I guess it makes sense. Makes sense that magic is not like their strength. Oh, sh... Holy shit. I thought he was dead. Alright. We've had quite a few near deaths in this episode, which is, I'm not sure that's a good thing. That guy's unfortunately shooting at me, and I'm missing all my spells. Oh, fuck all of you, then. 
on ah shit he walked off walked off before I could drench them in lava all right gonna I'm running out of life gems I really should go back and buy some more I have the souls for them once I get to the next bonfire great I'm out of great heavy soul arrows ah well shit I didn't think he'd, he could hit me from there I oh, still have four Estus flasks. Oh, by the way, I realized on my second playthrough that the reason I kept falling in is that there are these sneaky switches here that basically screwed me over. Oh, that guy is shooting at me. A fire Drake stone, that's actually pretty nice. Let's take him out. If I can hit him. Good. I won't wait for him to shoot. Seriously? I, I guess I was in the range. Should've just like not waited there. Oh, it can go through there? Well, I guess it kind of would. Hate how that arrow curves. Alright, let's fucking kill this guy. I might need to use an amber herb if things start to get really desperate. But hopefully we won't reach that stage. Now if we want to screw over these guys. Goodbye. And see you later. <laughs> I kind of love doing that. I'm gonna pick up large soul of a nameless soldier. I'm going to head straight for the bonfire. There is like a lot of items around here. There's a mimic here. Oh wait, went the wrong way. There's a mimic here and everything. I'm gonna come back and do all of those later. But not right now. Right now my priority is to stay alive. Come on, go in the fire. Such an idiot. Okay, doing well so far at... I'm almost at half HP. So, yeah, um, keeping these SS flasks close to me, definitely. Alright, two more enemies to deal with. Yeah, two of these guys, who are not really too bad. They could be a lot worse. Oh, sh what? Where did, where did this guy come from? What the fuck? Wait a second, where did... There is an Alon Knight here? Fucking hell. Uh, gonna have to do all of this shit all over again. This episode is not going the way I expected. I expected to get the Smelter Demon in like a few tries. But apparently that's not working out. And the problem is... Ah, shit. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna clear these guys out and we'll try Smelter one more time. See you guys in a second. Okay, let's get going here. Gonna go ahead and summon Lucatil. Use the humanity in the end. Um, I, dis I tried once again to get summoned, but I was like, you know what? Fuck it. I'm not gonna waste time. Alright, Lucatil. Let's go. Let's take this motherfucker down. Okay, just... Gotta make sure I'm recording. As always. This is like my main concern. Especially with games like Dark Souls. Is that I forgot to hit record. That would especially like annoy me. Because... I mean, if the recording like gets corrupted or something. There isn't much I can do about that. But if it's my fault... I'd be pissed. Alright, you should be going into phase two now. Good. And look at you, you know, you can just hold off and save your stamina. Probably a good idea to spend my souls at this stage, or my soul arrows at this stage, because look at you, will take less damage. Okay, he's going for his thing. This is the hard part. This is the 
serious shit. Especially if I could hit him, that would be like a major advantage. Okay, thank you, Lucatil. That's how you make yourself useful, see? Alright. Not doing too terribly. F oh shit. That's not good. Thank you, Lucatil. She probably saved my ass quite a few times in this battle. Well, if we actually win, that still remains to be seen. Could just stand here and spam my sorceries, because I think she's going to make it at this point. I know it's cheap, but it's in the game for a reason. And that reason is for me to abuse it. Alright, let's go. No! And it's dead. I was worried for a second there. Didn't survive with much, much HP. I wanted to take him out with melee. Thank you, Lucatil. Alright, so basically, we are now guaranteed to get her stuff. Even if she... Uh, you know what, probably... I'm gonna summon her for the rotten just to be safe. But I think we should be fine. I'm gonna go ahead and get the porcine shield. And, oh yeah, there's flame butterflies there too. How much time do I have left? Wait there. Like, I was at 40 minutes. I still have like quite a few minutes left. 32,000 souls. Do I want to risk it? Will I be able to get to the bonfire in time? I don't know. But I can definitely take out this guy. With a backstab. Well, that's not gonna kill him. You know what? I think I'm gonna be smart. And I head back to Majula. Yeah, now that I think about it, why risk this many souls? Because at this point, this is still quite a lot. I can always use the next episode to go through the rest of the keep. And the old Iron King is such an easy boss. I should have no problem killing him on my first try. After that, I'm probably going to go ahead and head down to Tseldora. Yeah, I think that's where we'll go next. I'm going to leave the Black Gulch to last. Especially since there is a really powerful weapon that I want to get. From, what's her name? Freya. Okay, where is the... Oh, there she is. There you are, girl. Yeah, let's talk. All right. So, pretty much at this point, our intelligence is at 35. Okay, we're going to get this. I need to get... Hmm. You know what? We'll go with 14 decks. Just so that I can get the Jester set a bit later. Because that is very important. Not this whole set, but just the helmet. Alright, where to next? Might as well buy the set. I think I have enough souls for it. Uh, basically, I think I've talked about this before, but inside the Undead Purgatory, there are these mage guys, and they have this thing called the Lizard Staff, which pretty much um, is one of the best int catalysts until, like, the end of the game until like the dragonary the problem is there are only two sorcerers inside the boss room and they're the only ones that drop it so that one is gonna be a difficult farming run that's why i want to get these uh things that i want to get the covetous gold serpent ring too simply so that i can have a chance of, or i don't have to like uh quit the executioner chariot fight like 50 times. It might still happen because I don't actually know what the drop rate is on that thing, but it's pretty rare, I think. Okay, let's see if I can afford this. Yes, I can. This is what we want. Raises item discovery. Alright, see you later. Okay. This probably looks really stupid on me. Yep. 
doesn't work with this set at all. That is just creepy. This one looks cool. I don't really have any... No, well, I guess this kind of works. I do have a set planned out that I'm going to buy. It's a set I like quite a lot. But that's going to be for, la for later. So yeah, I'm going to end it here. I want to guys... Oh, way to screw up the ending. I want to thank you guys very much for watching. Sorry this is kind of like uh, an all over the place episode. Um, in the end, I killed the smelter demon. And that's all that matters. So yeah, I'll end it here. And I'll see all of you next time. Goodbye.